Well, season 45 is in full swing and the main attraction of the season 45 at least for me is the Dragunov because at season 45 we have gotten a brand new weapon the Dragunov and here you can still get it at level 60 and then you can get one more Dragunov at level 80 and plus at level 80 you'll be able to get here one more blueprint for the Dragunov and speaking of those blueprints check this out I have already recycled one of my Dragunovs and I was able to get side times 6 blueprint and let me actually show you all the Dragunov blueprints that I already got. I actually have two blueprints. I have one side times six that I've gotten by recycling one Dragunov, and I've gotten the side times 10 blueprint by reaching level 80 on season 44. So today's goal is to kind of progress a bit further here in the season pass. I want to get there as fast as far as we can. Maybe we'll even reach level 33 today. I think we should be able to reach level 33. There we'll be able to get some more extremely rare mods. And hey, now we have a raid outside. So Let's get ready. Let's go and let's do that raid. But hey, before we begin, I'd also love to say huge thanks and shout out to our today's stream sponsor, which is Fishing Clash. Make sure to check out Fishing Clash. Link is down in the description. Or you can scan that QR code if you're watching it on TV or if you're watching this live stream on TV or, or on your PC. It's a mobile game. It's available on Android and iOS. So yeah, make sure to check it out. Link is down in the description or check out the QR code plus... You can use the code Happy Cyric. We're going to play the game a little bit during the live stream a little bit later. So no worries about that. But yeah, uh, make sure to also check out the QR code, uh, scan it. And uh, once you get the game, uh, activate the gift code Happy Cyric and you'll be able to get uh, $20 worth of rewards for free. But hey, we're going to talk about that a bit later as we have a raid to do. But before we do that raid, I actually want to go to the gas station. Correct? And at that gas station, I'm going to try to repair the Dragunov and maybe we'll do like some sort of a, of a raid with the Dragunov. So let's check it out, ladies and gentlemen. Some of you might be like, Sayak, why do you want to waste those Dragunovs? Why not? Why wouldn't I want to waste them? What else am I going to do with them? They added them to the game. We we're talking about those Dragunovs. I might as well just use those Dragunovs. And hey, welcome, welcome to all those that have just joined the stream. Hopefully you're having a great day. If I'm not mistaken, today is... Saturday, unless you're watching this live stream on another day. And if you're watching it on another day, then hey, let me know. And there will be also timestamps, so you can use those timestamps to navigate to your favorite parts of the live stream a bit quicker. Like us doing raids, us opening up some crates, or some whatever other stuff. So there we go. We have just repaired the Dragonova. We can clap for it one more time. And let's go, ladies and gents. Let's go, let's go. Let's do it. So once again, welcome, welcome to all those that have just joined. I'm glad to see you all over here. There's lots of you in the chat. I can't say every one of your names, but hey, welcome, 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 welcome. Hello, hello. Hopefully you're having a fantastic day. And that is it. This is going to be our raid. Let's go for it. I don't really know if it's a smart idea to bring that Dragunov there. Obviously, it's not a smart idea, but it is a fun idea nonetheless. So that's why we are bringing it there. What would you say is the best way to get Tactical Backpack for free-to-play players? the best way to get tactical backpacks for free to play players um, I'm thinking right now my brain is working at full capacity and I have no idea I mean you can get the tactical backpacks by spinning caps at the gas station or 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 from the things whatever they're called the supply event currently we don't have that supply event but you can also get it at the supply event so those are the two best ways of getting a backpack okay let's drop a C4 on this wall here Let's wait until the thing explodes. There we go. The thing just popped. That is buggers. And we're going to deal now with these fast biters. We're going to put the fast biters to sleep. Oh, actually, we got the drug enough, so I might as well just use it. I mean, it does increase our noise just a tiny bit, but... I mean, it is worth it. <laughs> it is worth it. For the drug enough, it is absolutely worth it. In my humble opinion. All right, I think I'm gonna open up a few more chests. Let's open up a chest here. And let's see, usually this chest is supposed to have something nice like guns, but I'm not sure. Okay, this time we got nothing. We got two bandages, two stacks of bandages actually. So yeah, because sometimes whenever there's like room like this with a CB radio and usually this room here, like the chest here or here, usually has like some guns. There are a bunch of like bases like that with like three by three stone room. And usually they have like a gun or two. But hey, this time we got two stacks of bandages, which maybe is even better than a gun. So there's that. 
Let's open it up here. Okay, we've got uh, some zip guns. I'll probably bring them back to the base just so that I can recycle them. So yeah, let's take them. Let's get the zip guns. I can't believe I'm bringing zip guns back to the base. But hey, that's what this raid has to offer. I'm gonna get some steel. All right, and we got another raid. Uh, another wave, excuse me. I just have to pay attention to not break my Dragunov. And again, for those who do not know, you can shoot Dragunov 35 times before it breaks. So there's that. Or you can shoot it 34 times before it breaks. I think it has 35 shots. You got the point. So be careful. Be careful. Don't break it. I'm gonna open up this chest here. Okay, we've already opened it up. I got nothing. Okay, we got one more chest to open up. Let's get in. Let's get that all. Hmm. Nothing useful. So that's it. Does this base get Sykes approval? I mean, we did get a gun. We did get three zip guns and two stacks of bandages. I mean, I'd give this raid a 2 out of 10. But does 2 out of 10 get Sykes approval? Probably not as... Quite recently, a few weeks or maybe a few months ago, I have raised the Sykes approval uh, score level, whatever. Now you need to get 3 out of 10 to get the Sykes approval. And this base is like 2 out of 10. So it does not get Sykes approval. So there is that. Okay, while we are here, we might as well just quickly go to the settlement real quick. And maybe I'm going to get some daily gifts there at the settlement. And then we'll go back to the base. We'll deposit that stuff and we'll probably do some more raids. Today is the laboratory event. I'm not really sure if the laboratory is reset. Maybe it is. Maybe we'll blast through the laboratory quickly. Because we can also get some season points there. Say, so maybe I will clear the laboratory. We'll see. We will see. Perhaps I'll do it. Maybe. Or maybe no. Only time will tell. How do you want to get more Dragonovs from the Season Pass? You get more Dragonovs from the Season Pass. Also, for those who do not know, you can get more Dragonovs in these infinite packs. Once you unlock all of these mods, right? Eh, all of the blueprints. Then I think here in the right corner, you will be able to get a Dragonov instead of blueprints. But I still haven't unlocked all the blueprints yet. So that's why I can get more Dragonovs. But you can still get two Dragonovs from the Season Pass. Or at least one if you don't have the full Season Pass. Okay, we're done with that. We've gotten some daily loot. Let's go back to the base. Let's deposit this stuff and let's call the raiders on the radio once again. Maybe we'll even clear some Bunker Alpha because Bunker Alpha is also a great way to level up the season pass. Because last time I... I had to struggle to level up the past few levels, like from level 60 to level 80, I had to sweat a bit. Because I only had like two days to level up, so I had to get 20 levels in two days. So this time I'll like try I'll try to do more locations. I'll try to progress a bit further so that I don't have to sweat during the last day. But it was kind of fun to sweat a bit. I'm not gonna lie, it's always fun to sweat once in a while. Play some expeditions, says Muhammad. Maybe. Maybe we will do some expeditions. But I quite doubt it. I can't promise it. But I doubt that we will do any expeditions. Okay, let's drop the zip guns here. And I'm gonna drop the rest of the weapons that we've just gotten. Plus some um, of these go there. And there we go. Now, it's time for us to pay the raiders. We could pay them with spears. I actually wanted to give them an electronic circuit. But hey, we can pay them with spears. So let's just do it. Um, Thinking. Okay, the spears. That's what I wanted to do. Let's craft the spear. Let's give those schmucks a spear. And I'll skedaddle from here. Actually, on the second thought, come back. Still saw them on the minimap leaving. Well, I gotta wait until they spawn back. We're gonna talk to them. I'm copying your base layout. It's kind of cool. So organized, says Ryan. Thank you very much. Thank you. Most of the time, people say that my base is unorganized. But it is organized. This is a beautiful base. This is a beautiful base. And gets my approval. Okay, we have to kill the colonel at the factory. We will do that. Plus, we have to do 20 waves, which I think we should do. Because by doing 20 waves, we'll get some more points towards the season pass. And it's just like a win-win. I'm getting... I'm gonna do 20 waves. Raiders will be happy. I'll do a raid. And plus, I'll get some more points towards the season pass. So that's what we're gonna do right now. Ladies and gentlemen. That's what we're gonna do right now. Uh, this... Um, this goes there. I'll probably get a few spread shots. Why not? Good morning, sorry. Hope you're having a good day, so Jessica. Welcome, welcome. Hopefully you're having a great day as well. 
Welcome, welcome. I'm probably gonna get some flare guns as well for the... No, no, we're not getting flare guns to the 20 waves. That would be stupid. Might be stupid, but I'm not an idiot. Okay, I'm gonna get... Maybe that's too many spread shots. We have a lot of VSSs here, but I don't want to use them. Maybe we have, like, some random guns inside of the inbox from all of those season passes. Okay, I have a few M16s. Let's get them. And an Uzi. For 20 waves, is that enough? That should be enough. With spread shots, that's enough. I'll get a flare gun, and, because why not? And I'll equip a brand new armor. Because why wouldn't I equip a brand new armor? Let's get this, this, and... Dude, I am definitely over prepping for these 20 waves. You know what? Maybe I'll do more. Maybe I'll do like 30 waves or something. It depends. Whatever. I got some more nades. We'll see how it works. And maybe I'll get another stuff. Take 20 grenades. Yes, indeed. And I'm gonna get another set of armor. How did you get a Sakura tree, Cyrix says Earth, and I have no idea when I've gotten that Sakura tree. It was available during some sort of a season. I guess that's how I've gotten it. Maybe some of you know how I've gotten that Sakura tree. Because I think that's how everybody has gotten it. So that's it. Raiders, see you later. We got it 20 waves. Let's do it. MGLs are better than grenades. Yeah, grenade launchers are better than grenades. But, I don't mind using grenades. They're fine. They're totally fine. Just do the season pass to level 60 and then buy premium pass. That's kind of easy, says I would just... That's maybe a nice tip and trick. To some people, maybe, maybe. Alright, let's... Uh, hop to the PD. There we go. It is reset. And that's what matters. Let's go. Sucker Tree was from Community Event Season, says uh, Raid Panic. Okay. Okay, I don't remember that, but... I know it was during some sort of a season. I totally have... But I have no clue what season was that. But if you're telling me that, we, that it was from the community event season, I believe that. Has Di Cyric died during the stream yet? No. I've never died during the stream. What do you mean? Zero deaths, baby. Zero deaths. Haven't died a single time. Not even once. It's like, where can I use my first MGL? Uh, you can use it at the PD. You can use those grenade launchers to kill friends and giants at Bunker Alpha if you gather all of them in one spot. Or you can save it for later. Okay, welcome, Raider. Good evening. I should have brought perhaps some blue cards. Maybe I'll just get blue cards here and then I'll open them up. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'll do. That's what I'll probably do, ladies and gentlemen. Scum video says Rocket. Maybe there will be some more Scum Survival videos. Not maybe, but there will be more Scum Survival videos. Just don't know when, but soon. Soon, ladies and gentlemen, there will be more Scum Survival videos. I don't understand that stupid community event. I lost two sets of armor and I couldn't complete the one where you have to kill 12, 15, and 18. Could have gotten seven carbon composites around the white tree. Yeah, it is... Uh, it is a difficult event. And it's not really worth it. Will they nerf the wall trick soon to Scav Master? Nobody knows if they'll nerf it or not. They said that probably they will nerf it, but we don't know when. And we don't know if they will actually do it. And by... They will nerf the wall trick. We don't know what they mean by that. Do they mean that they'll nerf it further at, but at the farm location? Or will they nerf it in every other location? I have no idea. Nobody knows. I'll just pro We just probably have to wait. And see. I just don't want to cause here any panic right now. Because every time I speak about, like, that wall trick nerf... Which, again, that's what developers said. So I'm just saying what they said. But every time I, I mention, like, the... The possible wall trick nerf, people come to Discord and they start saying, Oh, Sark told me the wall trick will get nerfed. But yeah, in any case, Dev said that maybe the wall trick will get nerfed further. But when that happens, if that'll happen, I have no idea. 
That's it. That's all there is. I forgot the community event existed, says Jayla. Yikes. I mean, I can't blame you. Community event is pretty goop. The community event is the definition of goop. The commune event is pretty goop. Okay, wait, I'm gonna get this. I think I saw something. There's a fly flying here. Unbelievable. Your sound was changed. Please bring it back. Everything is the same. I don't understand what you're talking about or everyone, so... Get some help. But sire... You're hearing voices. Nothing has changed. What are you talking about? Uh, let's get the spread shot. I spoke to a mod and they said that they probably won't nerf Waltrick in Bunker Alpha says Vis City. I mean, mods know more than the devs, right? I mean, again, the mods and everybody else, we can all just speculate. We have, we have nothing but speculations. Maybe they'll nerf something, maybe they won't. Maybe they'll nerf it at Bunker Alpha, maybe they won't. Maybe they'll nerf it in other locations, maybe they won't. I have no idea. I'm talking about the background sound when you're playing Last and it says Revenge, so... There we go, we have the same soundtrack that's been always playing for four years, for six years, probably. What are you talking about, mate? Let's add this. Let's go to the fifth floor. Actually, it's not a fifth floor. It's a fifth wave. In any case, after this wave, we'll probably start dropping grenades. What can be done to make last and it more popular, says Big Chilling? I have no idea. Spend more money on advertising, maybe? More, more better updates? I don't know. I have no idea. I'm not a PR consultant, I have no idea. Okay, let's get him. Whoops. I need only two carbon composites to finalize the eight pieces game killer. Okay, good luck with your two carbon composites. Hopefully you'll get them soon. I mean, if you've gotten the rest of the resources already for the ATV, I'm sure you'll be able to get those carbon composites. I'm sure you'll be able to get that stuff. I believe in you, you can do it. Okay, let's go here. Let's try to throw that grenade. Oh, what? Did you see that? It was knocked back. Wait, what? What happened with that grenade? It just bounced back. And I was stunned here. Excuse me, is that normal now? Do these grenades bounce? Do these grenades bounce back now? If they do, why did they do that? It's stupid. They nerfed grenades. Wait, is that normal? I'll try it once again. Uh, let's go for another wave. Okay, we gotta throw the nade. I'm gonna stay on top of it. I'm waiting. I'm leaving and boom. Whoops, I kinda got hit with it as well. That's fine. You throw it at the zombie. I mean... It has never happened to me before. It happens to me all the time since Pink Lady. It's the first time it happened to me. I've been throwing these grenades since forever, and it's the first time I've seen that. Wait, I'm gonna wait for them to come a bit closer. There we go, just threw it and it got stuck. It was fine. Now this time grenade exploded properly. Hmm. I have no idea why it didn't work last time. In any case, we can still use these grenades, everything's fine. Cooking chicken nuggets and watching Happy Psych Life is good. Cooking chicken nuggets, do you boil them, you mean? Excuse me, sir. But I agree with you, life is good. When it comes to chicken nuggets, life is good. Okay, whoops. Did you know that chicken nuggets grow in trees? You can plant a chicken nugget. Just be careful when you plant it. If you plant it in the winter, it won't grow. You have to plant it like in the summer, perhaps in spring, and it'll grow. 
like a little chicken nugget tree. And people call me stupid. I know my stuff. I know biology. I know what's up. Scum just got a 4 gig update. Only? I mean, it's always getting like... Sometimes... Uh, yeah, it's always getting huge update, uh, huge patches. Uh, huge everything. It ain't the first time. No, 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 I mean, uh, baking it in the oven says a button. Okay. So you're baking your chicken nuggets. Understandable. I mean, I, I, I don't judge you if you boil them. It's fine. You do what you gotta do. Okay, have we gotten a single blue? Nope. Just one green. Just one silly green card and that's it. Well, let's go for another wave, ladies and gentlemen. I threw it a little bit too early. Oh no, it worked fine! Oh no, it didn't work fine because we did not damage that brawler, so... It deserves the sad piano. Wave 99 should have some sort of a mini boss alongside zombies. With just one big boss, says uh, Tam Football Edits. Makes sense, but at the same time, I want that boss to drop us something nice. Maybe at wave 99, we should get like a purple card. Maybe it doesn't have to be like some sort of a huge boss, but... It would be nice to get like some sort of a special... Special boss here and level 99 guys here. Go there, there. Here's an idea. Just just look hear me out the warden We get the warden boss like the, the prison warden, you know the dude comes out you kill him and You got a purple card. I mean, it doesn't have to be like that difficult like 500 health like some sort of a, a ravager Or whatever and you get a purple card from that dude. It would be boggers It's like you're a genius. I am NOT a genius. I was just inspired by the comment the warden. I mean, the warden, the prison warden. They have wardens. Genius. I went to transport hub for the first time today. And defeating the miner, impossible for me without the reanimator, says Ankush. Actually, here's an amazing tip and trick. You have to probably use reanimators for the miner. It will help out a lot. You should probably use them actually there. Yes, that is a good idea. It's like, what is the ad on the screen? Oh. Uh, down here, it's Fishing Clash. This live stream, the portion of the live stream is sponsored by Fishing Clash. We're gonna play it a little bit later, so make sure to check out the game. We're gonna play it for a few minutes today. And then we'll get back to Lies and Earth, so no worries about that. But uh, that will happen a bit later. So make sure to check out Fishing Clash. Link is in the description or here. The... Yeah, it's a mobile fishing game. It's available on Android and iOS. Let's go for one more wave. Sponsors like Fishing Clash support the channel. And because of these sponsors, we can play more Lies Earth. We can do whatever other things here on the channel. So thank you guys for your support. Thank you for supporting the channel. And thank you for supporting the devs that support the channel. Thank you guys. And let's go for the wave 18. Another one. So he'd be wave 100. I mean, he could be wave 100 or wave 99. I wouldn't mind that, but yeah. I would like the warden boss that would give us a guaranteed purple card. Because that's what I want. Uh, let's do one more wave. Wave 19, baby. Let's do it. For those who do not know why we are here, first of all, Raiders asked me to do 99 waves. So that's why we were doing that. And second of all, I kind of want to do these waves to progress a bit further in the season pass. Dude, I'm already at level... Oh, I get it. I leveled up, but I didn't get anything because we don't have the season pass. So that's why I wasn't getting any rewards and I thought that we haven't leveled up. But I assume we're going to be at level 29. That is good. That is lovely. They say change the armor. I keep checking the armor durability every wave. And we still have some durability. I still think we can do one more wave with it. We're gonna play Spider-Man 2. I haven't played Spider-Man 1. I haven't played any Spider-Man games, in fact. But perhaps one day I'll play the Kilometers Morales or whatever the dude's name is. I'm European, so his name is Kilometers Morales. There we go. Let's throw another grenade. Heal! Okay, my character didn't want to heal now. Well, my armor broke, but everything's calculated. So don't think that a hey, stupid psych doesn't know what he's doing. Calculate it. Got him. Wave 20, no? Yes, yes, we are doing 20 waves. 
Nice joke, kilometers morales. Yeah, sadly it's not my joke. I didn't come up with it. Like that joke is all over all over the internet, but hey. I'm gonna say it. Why not? Okay, we got some ride zombies. Wait, I did bring these flare guns. I might as well just use them. Why not do it? Two blues in one wave, says Apollo. I didn't even know that. Also, guys, I haven't mentioned you, but if you don't pick up cards every wave, they might despawn. Well, you don't have to pick them up every wave. Maybe pick them up every, like, two, three, every four waves. Maybe every five waves, because once the... Uh, once, there, uh, once the game hits the maximum amount of dead bodies, those bodies will start despawning. So there's only a limited amount of dead bodies that can be on the map. And once you hit that limit, they start despawning. Let's be careful. I don't know the limit. Once, like, maybe I need to count it. Like, I'd like to know that fun fact. Like, it'd be cool to know how many dead bodies uh, there can be. Okay, let's go one more wave. We still have like 17 nades, so I think we'll do like 17 more waves. Even though we are already done with this task, we can go for another raid, but... I mean, we might as well just do some more waves to progress a bit further in the season pass. Because why not? It's 104 brown cards, 18 green and 3 blue. Drop for 34 waves for 12 guns and 5 set armor. Worth it, says Aromal. 104 brown, that's 10 green, uh, 28 green and 3 blue. 28 green and 3 blue. Yeah, that's fine. That's about right. That's pretty decent. You waste- you use 12 guns and 5 sets of armor. 5 sets of armor? On 30 waves? I- what were you doing? That's a lot of armor sets, but whatever. I mean, armor sets are... Are basically useless. You can craft them so they don't count. 12 guns and you've got an... 3 blue cards. That's already like 6 guns. Plus you've got an 28 green cards. That's gonna be like at least 10 guns, maybe more. You can get like 20 guns maybe even from that. Plus a bunch of melee weapons. So it is worth it. You have gotten the profit. If you don't exchange your green for blue, you have gotten profit. So it was worth it, absolutely. You have to check in one day how many waves before it despawns to Sam. I agree. I'd love to check it one day. Maybe somebody in the chat will check it, but... I don't know, we'll see. If nobody checks it in the chat, I'll check it. Uh, let's go for the wave 26. Let's do it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's do it. Hey, Sarek, aka Darius. Did you know Darius is a person name, says Bagha? I've heard of that. I actually did hear that from some other people, and I've read that as well. Okay, how about we deal with bad zombies and put them to sleep? Oh, actually, let's not forget about the flare gun. I keep forgetting about it. It's gonna be nice against these bad zombies. Almost perfect, I'd say. Around 30 body psych. I already checked, it says Angel. Hmm, I don't know if you're just trolling or you are being real, but I'm gonna trust you because why not? How's the stream so far? Says Delta Raptor. Welcome to the stream. The stream is going great. Everything's going great. I say that uh, I, sp I speak for everybody when I say that the, spe the, the stream is going great. But say, I don't like it. I said that it's going great. You like the stream. Okay. It's not democracy. If I say that you like the live stream, you like the live stream. You have to enjoy it. You're obligated to enjoy the live stream. That's it. However, you are not obligated to smash the like button on the live stream. But I mean, you can do it if you want to. But I know you're scared to do it, so it is what it is. I get it. If I were you, I'd be scared to smash it as well. Oh no. The explosive zombies. Unbelievable. It did not pop. This 
disappointment is immeasurable. Does the flare gun still continue doing damage if the riot zombie puts a shield up? But uh, don't think so. I think it'll start doing only one damage. That'll be my guess. I mean, we can check it out, probably. We can test it, but I probably doubt it. Both. Okay. How about I do one spread shot? Okay, the guy put up a shield. Wait, we're gonna do it, do it differently this time. I'm gonna wait until it drops the shield. And then I'll shoot it, and then I'll touch it again. And then it'll pick up the shield, and then we'll see if... What happens here? Okay. You can't- I can't even see it because he doesn't pick up the shield. In any case, with the shield, we, we don't do damage. I know we do only one damage with the shield, or zero even. Not one, but we do just zero damage with the shield- without the shield. With the shield. You got the point! Yes. Absolutely. Um... You might be like, Psyche, are you stuck? Yes. The brain stopped working there for a second. Whoops. Oof. That worked pretty well. I want to get another one of these. I'm trying to save the police station for Red's... What? You want to clear the, poli the PD here. You have to get grenades. Keep clearing motel every few days. Just get the grenade from the motel as you get a guaranteed grenade if you have the burglar park. They're inside of that burglar room. We can get one nade. I'm gonna get this. Let's begin. And let's go for another wave, ladies and gents. Buckaroos. Okay. I wanna get back my flare gun. We get lore for Lash and Earth Cyric. We'll get full mad pad on it probably. What? Like Lash and Earth lore, and you think Mad Pad is gonna make a video about Lash and Earth lore? Hmm. That'd be poggers. I mean, I doubt it, but that'd be poggers. I like Mad Pad. Flare gun. There's not good efficiency way to get purple mods. It's just luck. Absolutely. It's all about luck, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, we still have seven more grenades. Wow. I didn't expect that we'll be doing here that many waves. I thought we're just here to dip in and dip out. And here we are. One nade for one and a half days, so you need 150 days to do PD. Sounds about right. Welcome to Last Enter. Let's go wave 35. Another grenade. Oh, whoops! I got some damage. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, five more nades, baby, and then we can skedaddle from here, and we can go for the second raid of the day. We haven't gotten a good raid in, a, in quite a while now. Maybe today's raid is going to be decent. But I can only hope. <sighs> How do you time the grenades right? Uh, I mean, I can quickly explain what's going on through my head before I throw these grenades and what I'm looking out for. So, when I begin the wave, all you have to do is just tap that grenade. You don't have to do anything, you don't have to throw it, you just have to tap it real quick. So, but we go here, and I go here, and I just tap the grenade, that's it. It doesn't matter whether it throws it. I stay on top of it, and then I just leave after... I know, you just feel it. You just kind of feel when you have to leave. Just throw a few grenades and you'll feel it. Maybe you wait a second. Maybe like second and a half. I don't know. 
but then you just gotta leave. And that's it. Even if it explodes in your face, like, it's fine. Just have full health. And you should be okay. Okay, there we go. Wave 38. I'm gonna throw one more grenade here. I'm stepping on top of it. I'm waiting. And there we go. I'm leaving. Check this out. The grenade kind of damaged me, but that's fine. It does happen time to time, but I had enough health and we did not die. Okay, let's go wave 39. Let's throw it. I did throw it a little bit too early. There we go. There's another mistake. Like, sometimes that will happen. Be ready for that. There is a remedy for it. Before you throw the grenade, you can look at the minimap to see if those zombies are chasing you or not. If they have spawned yet or not. Sometimes they take a while to spawn. So there we go. Let's go over here. I'm going. They haven't spawned yet. There we go. I'm throwing the grenade. I did wait here about half a second. They're here. I'm leaving. And boom. There we go. They all pop. I mean, you just, you just have to practice a bit. Just throw a few grenades and you'll know what's up. We need an updated 5 to 8 raids or 10 lol raids in one video, says some. Eh. I doubt it. Like, I'm not excited to make another one of those videos. Like, absolutely. Not even a little bit. Uh, I guess that's it. We can end it. There we go. Let's stop. 40 of these waves. But hey, perhaps one day soon I'll make another video. Perhaps one day soon, like Kefir soon. Maybe in a year, maybe in two years. Or maybe never. We'll see. Will we still continue day our survival playthrough? I doubt it. Okay. We have gotten green and blue. I think I'd exchange green for blue. But again, guys, don't exchange green for blue. I'm doing it because... Yeah. But you shouldn't do it. It's better to save your cards. I'm gonna open up... Uh, maybe three blue. I'll save the rest for later. I don't want to open up all five blue just in case if... I get like a purple card or something like somehow, some way from somewhere. So I'm not doing it yet. Let's get this set of armor. Let's get the guns. And let's bring that stuff back to the base. Where did I get that aluminum plate? Why do I need it? Oh, actually, we've also gotten mods here. Didn't check. We've gotten this ergonomic grip for the Uzi. We've gotten this double magazine for the VSS. And here we've gotten two more shotguns and plus a Winchester mod, which doesn't really matter. We already have all of these mods, but it's kind of sad to get a Winchester mod. <laughs> That's why Winchesters are stupid. Not only they take space in these boxes, not only they take up that space, you could be getting another gun instead of that Winchester, but they also are taking up mod spaces. Instead of this Culminator side, we could have gotten, like, something better. Which, I don't really need anything, but you got the point. Like, people could be getting something better. So there is that. Alright, let's skedaddle from here. I did get a Dragunov mod in those boxes. I don't believe that, Chris. That's a lie. You cannot get bo uh, Dragunov mods there. So, hey, I'm gonna call it Cap. You Cap and... Don't Cap on the stream. It's like they, uh, they are survival. I have already played some they are on the channel. I think I made like four videos on it. So, there's that. What are the best upgrades for the chopper? First of all, uh, space. You have to be upgrading space for your chopper. Then... Everything else, like fuel efficiency. Uh, what else? I have no idea. What's Fishing Clash? We're gonna play some Fishing Clash a little bit later. It's today's sponsor here, guys. Make sure to check it out. Either scan the QR code if you're watching it on PC or TV. But it's a mobile game. Link is down in the description. If you're in mobile, get it on your phone. And yeah. Thanks guys for the supporting the devs. For supporting the devs that are supporting the channel. But hey, we go a raid to do. Do we have a raid to do? I guess so. Probably. Let's drop some of these things here. 
Anybody watching Cyric on TV says B-Joy. Yeah, do we have any viewers watching on TV? TV gang. Assemble. I do watch YouTube on TV quite often, to be honest. Recently I got the Chromecast or whatever, it's amazing. So I do watch YouTube quite often on YouTube. Uh, on I do watch YouTube on TV quite often. Any tips for last dinner? It's a scar. Make sure to check out my free-to-play playlist. Link is down in the description. Me, I'm on TV. I'm on TV. Okay, so we do have some TV viewers. Say, so, welcome, welcome, TV viewers. Welcome, everybody. I watch Sayak on my Apple Watch, says Delta. I think that's Cap. I don't think you can watch YouTube videos on Apple Watch. On Apple Watches. I doubt it. I can smell lies from a mile away. But I guess speaking again of those like 10 raid videos, maybe there will be one more 10 raid video someday in the future. I can't say no. Maybe there will be. Maybe, maybe. I'm giving you like a little bit of hope. Maybe there will be some more like 10 raid videos in one video. Uh, this and there we go. We have sorted out our inventory, ladies and gentlemen. We absolutely de did it. We did it. I really think that your background was changed, sorry. I mean, the background music did change a bit, but... Like, why does it matter, mate? Stop it. Oh, we also have to go and deal with the colonel at the factory. And then we gotta deal with the blind one. I'm not sure if we can do it, because I think I have activated the hard mode last time, or maybe we can do it, I have no idea. In any case, let's go to the factory real quick. Let's deal with the dude. I'm not gonna clear the full factory, because... It is kinda lame. You can guys thumbs down the in the chat here. You can send the, the emote. Thumbs up or thumb, some thumbs down for the abandoned factory. Actually, I'm going to make a poll, guys. Don't worry. Uh, do you like the abandoned factory? The uh, abandoned factory. Yes, I like it. Uh, it's good. I don't know. Nah, it's good. Actually, I'm going to just give two options. That's it. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure to vote. Make sure to share your opinion. Because in my opinion, the abandoned factory is kind of goop. Like, it is pretty goop. You get nothing there. It is, like, pretty trashy. One of the trashiest places probably in the game. I used to like it at the beginning, says Mentos. Hmm. I only do it to get factory dish- uh, to satellite dishes. Satellite dishes are decent. If you need them. I mean, it's a decent place to get satellite dishes. My opinion is whatever you say, says Carl. Carl, you have to have your own opinion. I believe in you. You can get your own opinion. And we're good. We can roll, ladies and gentlemen. Whoa, we can do the emoji thing on the PC now. Oh yeah, the in the chat thing, guys. I can see the emotes flying there. The smiley faces going on the side there. I see them now. I think I can even show you what's what I'm talking about here. Uh, boom. There we go, guys. See these things going from the side. I can see them going now. There, there were the hearts. Uh, more things are coming. Go on, guys. Pop it, pop it, break them. I want to see them go there for the memes. I don't know what they do. I know that they've added them. I kind of didn't know them. If it weren't, f if it wasn't for a comment. That you guys left like a few weeks ago. I wouldn't even notice them. But there go. They're here. You can click on them and they'll start spamming. They're going, ladies and gentlemen. They're going. So, there's that. I can spam it like mad too, says uh, DA. Yes, indeed. Yesterday we were talking about food, remember? Yes, indeed. So, guys, thanks for spamming those emotes. I don't know what they do, but it's kind of cool. Sometimes when I look the when I check the chat, I see them go up. And I guess it's kind of cool. In any case. Let's hop on the chopper and let's skedaddle. Let's go for something. Hello, screen says insane. Welcome, insane. Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you're having a great day. Hopefully everybody's having a great day. Sorry, when is a new surrounded video? Soon-ish, I have no idea. You get one dollar per emoji. I mean, I wish it was like that. I'd be a billionaire. Uh, I'm thinking again. 
My brain has stopped working. Oh, we were going to the abandoned factory. It's like your brain can't stop working if it never started working in the first place. Guys, stop it! I have feelings. How many times do I have to tell you that? I am a very sensitive human being. And you keep dissing me. You keep making fun of me. I had McDonald's today in your honor. You say it in, in my honor as if I died or something. <laughs> Guys, if I die, eat a chicken nugget in my honor. Guys, stop it. Hopefully I'm not dying. Let's keep playing the game. Don't eat McDonald's in my honor. Unless it's a chicken nugget. I don't even like chicken nuggets that much. In any case, let's get the dude there. The whatever his name is, I forgot. Colonel? Not McDonald's against the eight. No, no, guys, we're not talking about it today. That's it. It's enough. It is enough. However, we are going to talk about fishing today. We're going to talk about Fishing Clash. It is a nice fishing game, but hey, we're going to play it a little bit later. And then we'll get back to last and Earth, so no worries. Okay, we got the Colonel. At the same time, maybe I should clear the abandoned factory because we can get what we can get here. I forgot. Uh, I'm thinking we can get the thing, whatever it's called, points for the season pass. But at the same time, I'd rather get them somewhere else than in the abandoned factory. But that's what I think about this abandoned factory. That's it. Factory is only worth it for the burglar chest, in my opinion, Siskara. Probably you are right. Uh, let's go back home. Yesterday, we talked about my homemade chicken deli meats. And let me say it. It tastes better today, says Angry Cyric. Um, there are some foods that taste better on the second day. What are these foods? I'm thinking about it. What are those foods that taste better on the second day? I mean, rice is fine. Like, if you boil fresh rice and eating rice the second day, it's fine. I mean, I don't think it tastes that much different. It is different, but I don't mind it. I wouldn't say it's better per se, but it's fine. Soup. Maybe soup. Pizza tastes better the second day, says Carl. Like, I have to disagree with that. That's it, Carl. I'm gonna assume that you were just joking. And yeah, guys, 64% of you said that the abandoned factory is goop. Understandable. Fries and chips? French fries better on the second day. Excuse me, sir! I'll never be able to recover from those comments now. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Abandoned factory. Somebody mentioned abandoned factory. Guys, we went to the abandoned factory just so that I can do a raid. Just so that I would get ready for the raid. Okay, we need to recycle three guns and craft some armor and deal with the blind one. Wait, can I go and kill the blind one right now? Let's not start talking about food. Like last time for two hours is bug hut. It was actually amazing. I like talking about it. Okay, it resets in one day, but I have no idea if we have activated the hard mode there or not. Do I go and check? Do I peek? I want to peek there. I want to kill the blind one. Unless I've killed the blind one yesterday already. I don't remember. I have no idea. I don't have the slightest clue. And I don't know if anybody else can help me with that. In any case, I'm going to get these uh, ultimatums. Because they're kind of decent against the blind one. I like it. I don't know where else we can use these ultimatums. So there's that. Let's get this. I'll get the Dragonov for the memes. And that's enough. Everyone loves food. One thing we have in common. Says so Jessica. I absolutely agree. I 100% agree with that.
Food is what keeps us alive. Just think about it. Quite recently, I saw a theory that what if, what if air and oxygen is actually poisonous? It just kills us in 100 years. Like it's it's a slow killer. It's a slow poison. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, it was like a meme, but you got the point. It is pretty funny. It is a fun meme, ladies and gentlemen. McDonald's burger tastes better after one week. Okay, that's enough. Sir, you've stepped too far. Go back in line. Wow, this fact make my legs shake. Okay. Alrighty. I don't know if that's good. Water has a pH of 7, says uh, Nicola. I mean, it depends. If you drink carbonated water, I think it has pH of... It has a lower pH. It's gonna have pH of... Actually, it's higher pH. The lower the number, the higher the pH. Oh my god, sorry. You're so smart. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Literally, I'm not even sure if that's true. In any case, I think the carbonated water, it has like pH between 4 and 5. I think it depends. In any case, let's see if the hard mode is activated. Okay, yes, indeed, the hard mode is already activated. pH of less than 5.6 is acid rain. What? Um, through third floor. You are very wrong with the pH number. Okay, sir. Uh, carbonated water pH. Okay, boomer. If you ever fight with me again, Drop kick here. Okay, you can't see this because of the face cam. I'm gonna remove it here. The average uh, for all cold carbonated waters pH is 4.5. And I said it's 4.5 or something because I wasn't sure what it is. So there we go. If you ever argue with me again, sir. Oh, I can't do anything here. I think I've already killed the big one, the, the blind one. Coke and Pepsi has a pH of 2.5. Well, I don't believe that. 2.5 is pretty acidic. I only I only knew those pH numbers because recently I got the got that soda stream machine and that's it. I was just curious about it and that's it. And plus my brother has a fish tank so he uh, he spoke a lot about pH of water. So that's it. That's how I knew about that number. That's it. I don't need to hear anything else. It's just like la 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 la, and that's it. Um. So yeah, guys, we can just go for the raid, I guess, because the blind one doesn't exist. Apparently, I've already killed the blind one. Unbelievable. Is Soda Stream good, says Jessica? Eh. It all depends on the preferences. It is probably more expensive. It's either the same price or a bit more expensive to keep the Soda Stream going than just buying new, new drinks. What's cool about the Soda Stream is if you like fresh, carbonated drinks, then Soda Stream is cool. If you're not really into carbonated drinks, then Soda Stream is pretty cool. There we go. Okay, let's go back home. Ladies and gentlemen, we gotta do a raid. I got so many guns. <sighs> to clear the third floor hard mode to kill the blind one, but he was already dead. Stop it! He's already dead! 
Well, we just danced on the boss's body. And we're going back to the base. That was almost a shower song. I have no idea what you're talking about, but let's say you're absolutely right. When will you do more free-to-play episodes? I think tomorrow there's a new free-to-play episode. So make sure to buckle up, do not miss it. Tomorrow there is a new free-to-play episode. Fortnite danced on the blind one. It do be like that. Okay, we need to craft some armor and the other... And we need to recycle three guns and then craft the armor. Okay, guys, let's do it. Uh, this. 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 And this. Okay, we're gonna drop it in the chest. Because that's what we gotta do, ladies and gentlemen. I wanna drop it in a chest. Blip blop, blip blop. Take a shot at the direct ship event. Okay, we we might actually do a shipwrecked event. It's a good idea. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna go for a raid very soon. We're gonna recycle these three guns. We're gonna skip through them. And then we go a raid to do, ladies and gentlemen. But hey, before we do that raid, actually, we're gonna play some. Uh, yeah, let's get ready for the raid. Psych! What happened? Are you lagging? No, I'm not lagging. Ladies and gentlemen, I am not lagging. Maybe just a tiny bit. Maybe I'm just stuck. A, 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 a tiny bit. But uh, before we go to that raid, ladies and gentlemen, actually my character might die there. Wait a second. I need to... I need to skedaddle. They say face cam. My face cam is here. I'm always here, guys. The face cam is has never disappeared, guys. I mean, it looked like I got stuck because I didn't move, but the face cam is still there. Uh, this, this, and there we go, guys. So, uh, before we go to the raid, we're gonna play here some fishing clash. So, huge thanks to Fishing Clash for sponsoring this live stream. We're gonna go back to Last on Earth. Uh, no worries. Uh, we're just gonna play here some uh, Fishing Clash. So first of all, thanks to Fishing Clash for sponsoring this live stream. Thank you guys for watching the live stream. And make sure to support the developers that support the channel because of sponsors like Fishing Clash. I get to do what I like. I get to play Last Generate Survival. So yeah, guys, make sure to check out the game. A link is down in the description or you can scan the QR code. It's in the down left corner. Also, if you once you get the game, you'll be able to click over here and click on gift codes. And here, just type Happy Cyric and you will be able to get here some awesome rewards. Boom, we even have this image here. So uh, go there and you'll be able to get $20 worth of rewards for free. I can even tell you what kind of things you can get there. You can get a unique avatar. You can get a mythical lore card. You can get 50 lock power-ups and 30 weight power-ups. You might be like, Sarek, what are these power-ups? Well, they'll help you to catch bigger fish. For example, here we have these power-ups, right? Currently, we are located in the Lost World. So let's also quickly explain to you what Fishing Class is about, right? It's a fishing game. You have here lots of... I'm sure like a lot of you have probably heard of fishing games, right? So, uh, there are lots of different fishing maps here. Uh, lots of different fishing areas. So currently, I am located here at this uh, Lost World. And uh, yeah, each of these maps look kind of cool. Let's probably... Uh, let me show you how, how to fish here. We can just cast here. First of all, we're going to use this basic lure. Uh, with this basic lure, like universal lure, we can catch whatever fish here. We have a chance to catch like all of these fish probably. And once we get that lure, we can use this lure to catch like these certain fish. For example, if I want to get this saber tooth salmon, I can equip this lure. And let's just cast it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's do it. Does it have Dragunovs? I mean, I don't know if you fish with Dragunovs. Okay. Let's tap here. We're going to get our max combo. Let's see what we got here. Nice one. We got this. And plus it's a new record. We got the Sabertooth Salmon. Okay, so let's actually uh, claim it. And now let's switch to... You can also upgrade the Salmons. There we go. I can upgrade it three times. So that way we can get heavier Salmons now. 
uh, it's at level four. I mean, let's probably go and quickly get it. Uh, I think it should be a new record now as well because we just upgraded it. We got the biggest salmon last time and I think this will be a new record as well because we've just upgraded to level three. Whoops. Okay, just go for it. There we go, we did it. And we got Plesiosaurus. And uh, yeah, I absolutely butchered the name of this dude, but whatever. Okay, we didn't even get that dude with the saber tooth salmon, uh, salmon thing. We got some other dude. But you got the point. You will get here a heavier fish. Uh, you will be able to see here your uh, records here with this P thing. That's like your personal record. So here we have this lost world. Let's equip this. And with this universal lore, you get a chance to like catch like whatever fish here. And yeah. That way you will unlock your more uh, lures and you need these lures to do duels. I'm going to show you how these duels work, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go here. And we got the giant orthocone, whatever. We didn't, I think I already had one like this. I think I already had the giant orthocone. There we go, we already had this dude. The dude is at level five now. Nate, then we can do duels. I think I can even show you how these duels work. Let's show you the duels in this lost world. And then after that, we're gonna switch to a different map. Okay, maybe I will be able to do something. Okay, so let's probably get this thing. There we go, Dusky Hound. I should have probably upgraded it. Okay, so here we have to catch a Dusky Sound. So what happens here is basically you go in a duel. You choose one fish that you want to catch. And your opponent chooses what, what fish uh, he wants to catch. And then you both have to catch that fish. So you have to play in a certain map. And uh, yeah, there you go. We did it. We've gotten here a fish. We've got a Dusky Smooth Hound. It was at 540, like something. And uh, now let's get a lane snapper. There we go. Let's see if we can get a heavier lane snapper. My opponent caught a lane snapper at 250 to whatever that was. Probably pounds. In any case. And my lane snapper was a 288. Okay, we're just getting these personal points. 288. That was the weight. There we go. We still have 25 more seconds left. I don't think we kind of need to do anything here. We can just wait. Or we can try to catch here one more fish. Introduce me to the lady there. <laughs> there on the right. Okay. I need to catch the biggest fish. Then you'll be able to impress her. But hey, that is it. I think the dude uh, gave up. And there we go. We just won one of these duels. We got three of these hooks. And with these hooks... These hooks go down here as well for it. Look at this. The, it went 3 out of 10, and then we'll be able to open up this pack. And, uh, yeah, wait. It teleported us to the Florida coast. Even though I did a, a duel here in this lost world. In any case, let's go back here. And let's open this up. Let's open up these pack of lures. And that's how you kind of level up in this game. And uh, let's skip the animation. And there we go. We've gotten some Florida coats and some of these other fish that you can level up and then uh, do a bit better duels. So, guys, to those that have just joined, once again, a huge thanks to Fishing Clash for sponsoring this live stream. We're going to get back to Last Earth and we will do a raid there very soon. So, no worries. Uh, but hey, I kind of want to show you some other maps here. So, we are located in this uh, lost world. There are the Himalayas. I mean, we can probably check it out. I like the maps here, actually. Like, they do look kind of cool. They do have a vibe here. But anyway, let's catch probably a random fish and then we'll go somewhere else. I just want to show you here some of the maps that are available in the game here. Who needs to touch grass? Who needs to tra travel the world when you can play Fishing Clash? What is this thing? Zigzag eel. Looks like a worm. Okay, whatever. Let's claim this thing. I want to show you some other maps. Some of my other favorites. Uh, I like the... I like everything that looks kind of like gloomy, like the Lost World. I also like the... Where was it? I saw one. 
Uh, I'm pretty sure that was Amazon. There we go. There's the Amazon, uh, Amazon River. Let's go here. So yeah, uh, also here in the Amazon River, you can get different fish here. Everything here has... Uh, every uh, location has here different fish. Let's probably do another duel. We'll see if we'll be able to do it. Also, there's like uh, the fishing battle. I didn't even show you that. So you can play here with eight players. There we already have here two players. As it says here, the battle usually starts within 10 seconds. Okay. We got to Galopago Islands and we have to get the Sailfin Grouper. I don't have the Sailfin Grouper, so there's nothing I can do about it. I can use the Sonar Power Up and uh, I can cast it. And let's see if I'll be able to find the Sailfin Grouper or whatever the dude was. So basically here you're going against eight people and the one that gets the biggest fish wins. If you have that fish, if you've caught it in the past, if you have the right lures for it. But I don't have it. So whatever. I mean, I can probably try to fish. But I'm not going to be able to get it. I still have only 10 seconds left here. So yeah, I'm definitely going to lose this this battle. Yeah, we got this fish and another fish here. And that's not what I needed to get. And that is it. You were 8th in the battle. And there we go. I got absolutely demolished, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, let's go here. Let's actually go for a duel, probably. Okay, once again, it threw me to the Florida coast. All right, maybe here at least I have a chance. Let's try to upgrade this thing. Not upgrade, but let's choose this fish. And, uh... Okay. Oh, we... The, I chose another fish and the dude chose a different fish. I don't know what he chose. In any case, I should have these fish here. So I should be able to catch them. Pretty sure fishing is prohibited there. I have a license. No license. Hey, I keep lying. I do have a license. Here in the game, I have an in-game license. Okay, then we have to get the yellow fin grouper. All right. I come to Papa. The guy is not even fishing. The guy maybe doesn't even have the right fish. Well, there we go. We got the yellow fin fin thing. And now we have to just chillax and wait here for 30 seconds until the dude, like, catches those fish. I mean, whatever. I can go probably for another one. Let's get this one. Maybe I'll be able to catch a bigger fish. A NASA-funded fishing trip. Fishing on moon? Excuse me, sir. Okay, Schoolmaster Snapper. Okay, it's not probably a bigger one. Maybe it was a bigger one. I think the other one was a 250 points. In any case, we've gotten more of these hooks. Let's claim that. And let's probably go to some other map. There are lots of cool maps. Let's go to somewhere in the winter, for example. I'm sure there are some winter maps. There we go, this Kuvzgul. I absolutely just butchered it. Let's go to the Kuvzgul. Let's go here. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. There's my horse. It's probably not my horse, but the horse is chilling. We can fish here on a different map. And let's probably begin. There was something I wanted to show you. Somebody spoke about the license. And we do have a license, except... I forgot where I found it. Okay, here we have our rewards. Is it in the... I think it's in the gear. There we go. Let's go to gear. And there we go. We have licenses, ladies and gentlemen. And... Uh, uh, okay, so this license works on this on this thing. We need to level up here and then we'll be able to uh, to get here some sort of bops to be able to catch bigger fish. Like, for example, uh, here, get higher license level to unlock. So we need to play the game here and uh, we'll be able to get more licenses. The cooler license and with that cooler license, we'll be able to get uh, bigger fish. Whatever, let's catch here some goop in the winter. With the horse in the background. Let's do it. Uh, 
there we go. What do we get here? A common days. Probably just butchered the name as well, but whatever. Do we have any other lures here? Okay, we have this thing. Let's equip it and let's cast it. So guys, once again, make sure to check out Fishing Clash. Make sure to support the developers that support the live stream because of sponsors like Fishing Clash. I get to play more Last Dinner than you guys like Last Dinner, right? Absolutely. Who doesn't like Last Dinner? Okay. Let's probably catch here one more fish. Introduce me to the horse. So his name is... Wait, uh... Not Jose. What was the, the horse that was stuck on the balcony? Uh, the meme with the horse stuck on the balcony, guys. You know the meme. What was the horse's name? Is it Jose? No, it's not Jose. It was a different... Juan! Yes, Juan! Absolutely. That's what I'm talking about. So his name is Juan. I've ruined the meme. I apologize, guys. I apologize for ruining the meme. I apologize for ruining the meme, but hey, I mean, we can go probably to another place. I'm here to show you uh, different maps. Okay, Yelpa, Fjord. We can go to Fjords, ladies and gentlemen. It's another like frozen map. Let's go here. There we go. People are there. The Juan is gone, guys. Say goodbye to Juan. Juan is no more. Juan disappeared. Okay, we have this different fish. Okay. Understandable. Have a nice day. So let's begin. Let's try to fish here at least for a bit. What happened? No last dinner. Guys, we're gonna go back to last dinner very soon. Meanwhile, make sure to check out Fishing Clash. They're the sponsor of today's live stream. And we got a haddock. Whatever that fish is supposed to be. change my lure to this thing. There we go. And let's begin. Okay, we got our max combo. I wouldn't eat this fish. So I'm just gonna say it's an L fish. Oh, we got a mythical fish. I did not have it before, guys. We have unlocked a mythical fish here. Check this out. Oh no, it's probably on another thing. Uh, my mistake. Uh, mistakes were made. In any case. Let's keep going. Okay, there we go. We got the max combo. Look at this. There's the moose going. I don't know if you can see it because of the face cam. But there's a moose. You gotta be kidding me. There was a horse. And now we got a moose. Unbelievable. And, uh, I mean, while we're at it, I might as well just show you one more map. Right. There's the deep sea. There's Hawaii. Have you ever wanted to go to Hawaii? Boom. There we go. We just teleported to Hawaii. And let's try to cast here our fishing rod. And let's catch a fish here in Hawaii. Okay, we got it. It's coming to Papa. And we got a short bill spearfish. I don't really know if it looks like a spearfish, but I, I'm gonna accept it. We got another spearfish here. So, ladies and gentlemen, that was Fishing Clash. Make sure to check it out once again. A huge thanks to Fishing Clash for sponsoring uh, a portion of the live stream. Thank you, Fishing Clash. And you guys, make sure to check out Fishing Clash because of Fishing Clash, we get to play other games and we get to keep I get to keep uh, continuing making videos here on YouTube so thanks to Fishing Clash thanks to you guys uh, for being here and uh, yeah make sure to check out the game link is down in the description or scan the QR code if you're watching on mobile or TV this game is available on Android and iOS and uh, once you get the game make sure to go here go to gift codes type here happy Cyric and uh, yeah you will be able to get $20 worth of rewards. You'll be able to get there a unique 
uh, avatar, you'll be able to get one mythical lore card, 50 lock power-ups, and 30 weight power-ups. As you already know, these weight power-ups increase here uh, your fish quad by plus 15%. Like, you'll get 15% extra weight to your fish. So, there's that. Once again, thanks to Fishing Clash. And uh, we're going to get back to Last on Earth. Uh, where is Last on Earth, ladies and gentlemen? Last day on Earth. We had almost a raid ready. So, we're going to go and raid. Uh, where is the Last on Earth? I don't see it. Ladies and gentlemen. There we go. We're back in Last Day on Earth. So, let's go for the raid, everybody. Let's buckle up, buckaroos. So, yeah, once again, make sure to check out the game. To support the devs. Now, so I can buy his drug knobs, thanks to fishing. Clash, says Rain. I mean, it do be like that. It do be like that. So, let's drop the zip guns and let's get ready for the second raid of the day. Downloaded and code claimed, says DA. Thank you, DA. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We're gonna play some more uh, fishing clash later. I think we can also create a clan there. I'm gonna create a clan so to everybody that downloaded the game, you'll be able to join that clan. Fishing clashers, assemble. Okay, we need to recycle three zip guns. So yeah, thank you guys for sticking around, and thank you guys for getting the game. And we're gonna... Oh yeah, let's recycle this. Where were my zip guns? Did I recycle three zip guns already? Didn't I get three zip guns? I don't remember. Oh no, we have just recycled one. But I took three zip guns in my inventory. What happened to them? Maybe I dropped them in the box. In any case. We can get these things. It is on mobile, guys. Yes, Fishing Clash is a mobile game. I did play it on an emulator, but it's a mobile game. Okay, we can get rid of the things that we totally don't need. I'm not gonna waste your time, guys, by finding space for that one spring. Doesn't make any sense. You definitely took three zip guns. Yeah, I think I dropped two zip guns when I logged, uh, logged back into Last on Earth. I think that's what happened. Okay, now let's talk to the raiders and let's get ready. Uh, let's complete that. Bam. And let's buckle up, ladies and gentlemen. You might be like, Sack, what are we going to do after? We're going to do another raid. That's the that's kind of the goal today. That's what I like to do. I like to do raids. And raiders give me some sort of tasks to do. Like, let's say, go clear the third floor, the fourth floor, and whatnot. And by doing those other tasks, I progress a bit further in the season pass. And yeah, and then I'll be able to get one more of these Dragunovs and one more Dragunov here. As I already said, once I get the Dragunov at level 60, I will recycle that schmuck. Just to get another mod, because why not? I don't need more than one Dragunov in my base. <sighs> it's probably not smart, but I want to recycle it. Will you do the laboratory event? That's a good question. I probably should, because in that laboratory event... Where is it? Oh yeah, it, it lasts for seven more hours. Yeah, in the lab event, we could get some more season pass points, but that's not really that many points. If they added an extra zero here... Hmm... Then we're talking. Well, maybe not an extra zero. Maybe they doubled the amount of points we get there. That would be maybe better. Maybe even tripled. That'd be proud of battle. Uh, that'd be probably better. Downloaded and done. The code says Troll Age. Thank you. Thanks, Troll Age. Thank you. Thanks for getting Fishing Clash. Uh, the brain is working now. You might be like, Psych, is it really working? It doesn't look- It does work it. It does work. Can't even- I might not be able to speak properly, but my brain does work. I'm trying to focus. But I forgot what I was doing. I forgot my name. I forgot who I am. Do commune, says Apollo. That Literally, that So can you pronounce my name correctly? Says. 
Muthukumara Sami. Like, that was flawless pronunciation of your name. If that's not how you pronounce your name, then... Uh, apologies. But that's how it should be pronounced, in my opinion. In my humble opinion. I'm somewhat of a name expert. Brain lag, it do be like that. The brain lags all the time. Oh, let's not forget the Dragunov. I do know that it's kind of stupid to take it. I'm not going to take the Dragunov here. What if we get a nice raid? I won't have space to bring more loot. It's like, you should... Uh, wait, it's like you should actually do community event for scientific purposes so we know why not to do it, says Carl. Guys, do you want me to go and do the community event? If you want me to do the community event, let me know the, in the comments. Maybe I'll make a poll here right now. If it's not how you pronounce it, change it, says Matthew. I agree with that. Any welcome, Matthew. Welcome, welcome. You are the only foreigner who, uh, foreigner who pronounced my name properly, says uh, Muthukuma Rasami. Thank you. Thank you. We got two raids. How is that possible? Oh, because we got a revenge raid. <gasps> oh. Double raid, ladies and gentlemen. So buckle up. It's like, do I have to put double seed belt? Yes. Don't be silly. Of course, I need two seat belts. LD raid. Let's begin from the survivor girl. Let's see what this raid is about. Hopefully, one of these raids is good. Why not both raids? Well, maybe both of these raids are good. I don't know. Oh, Lord. These bases are huge. Okay, we go here, we open up these boxes. I just want to see what kind of loot we can get to know. Okay, where do I get my Glocks? Okay, open up these chests and then I go up. Ladies and gentlemen, I see. Okay, so I see basically just random chests. Understandable, have a nice day. All right, I'm ready. Let's go for this raid, guys. Raid number two of the day, and then there will be a raid number three of the day. It's like you've played this game for many years. Are you not bored yet? I lived on this earth for 26 years, and I'm not bored of it yet. It's like, I got a mythical fish. To, oh, just congrats. Congrats on your mythical fish. I mean, you do get a mythical fish by redeeming the code. But yes. It's like, do you speak French? No, I do not speak French. I am learning French, but I don't speak French. I can say a basic sentence, but other than that, that's where my French ends. Will you play Undawn anytime soon? I doubt it. Undawn is... Uh, Undawn. There isn't enough con content there. That's it, guys. Like, we've done an Undawn livestream. Just make sure to check it out and you'll see everything there is to see. Like, there is no more content in Undawn. We have seen everything. No, that's my base, says Matthew. I am not sorry. I have to raid it. Actually, why is it so goop? Imagine if it was like real life. Again, guys, we are not raiding real players. We are raiding bots here. But imagine if we were raiding... If it was real life, you go into somebody's base and they're like, what are you doing here? And you tell them that, hey, your base is trash. Like, why is it so bad? There's nothing to take. And they just eat your food in front of your eyes. That'd be kind of brutal. Okay, let's get some more goop. I'll laugh so hard if you die from a C4 again. What do you mean, again? You're implying that I've died again from a... Uh, that I've died already once from a C4. Which I have to politely disagree. That's not true. How many Dragunovs do you have? I have two Dragunovs. It's like you have only one because you recycled the second one. 
Yes. But I mean, I I had two Dragonovs, okay? I had two of them. I have only one now. But I had two, so I'm gonna say that I have two of them. I had two. I had two Dragonovs, but I had to recycle one of them. I had two, but I had to recycle one. Does it make any sense? Yes, it does. Can you do more rust? Perhaps there will be more rust in the future. At least a decent raid. Yes, at least it's an okay raid so far. We all remember, it's like there is no shame to it. Again, guys, I don't mind feeling ashamed. It's fine. Like, feeling ashamed is a normal human behavior, but I've never died from a C4 doing a raid. That's just, like, a lie. What would I lie about it? Upper room has loads of thick clothes. You're low, you're low in thick clothes. I think I have like 300, 400 of thick clothes in the base. I am not really low on it. But yeah, I'm still going to go and loot the upper room. I want to see what we can get here. Look at all these chicken. Actually, look at all these chests. Let's pop some of them open. We got a Glock for free. That's lovely. Again, I have no idea what chests I'm opening up here. Like, just random. Uh, another hatchet. Let's get it. I'm gonna soften this chest up. Maybe I miss saw, but... Uh, when you made armor earlier, you had 67. Oh. I should have more. There's there's no way I have only three stacks of thick cloth. Maybe I do only have three stacks of thick cloth. I don't know. In any case, let's start opening up some of these things. Let's do it. You died from a C4. I remember. Guys, you're lying. You're making things up. Stop it. It's like, take the beans. No. I will stop taking beans. Beans are the curse of everything. I kind of don't want to die here. Go on a heal donut. Okay, there's an electronic circuit. I'll take it. Can I open up another chest here? Have I softened it up? Yes, I have. Heal up, idiot! A bunch of water. Okay, that's it. We can probably skedaddle from this raid. It did have probably some more things. If I need to get more thick cloth, I'm sure we can get some more thick cloth from other raids. Just kind of don't want to die from the big one here right now. Alrighty. Let's leave this bla- uh, This base. I want to say place and base. And it ended up being blaze. Troll big one on spikes, says Matthew. You can't... Uh, kill the big one on spikes. And Ash Ketchum says heal! Welcome Ash Ketchum to the stream. Welcome, welcome. Hello, mate. How you doing? Ooh, nearly through the window hit. I was actually expecting it. I mean, we did had we did have 70 health, so we should have been fine. How many tactical backpacks did you lose? Zero as well. Zero deaths. Can't lose a single backpack when I've died. Zero times. Pretty simple. It don't be like that. It's like, how do, be, how do I become a Last on Earth partner? You have to join their Discord. Join their Discord and you'll get all the information there. As I have no idea, but... Yeah, join the Discord. Ask the people there. They'll definitely let you know what's up. They'll tell you what's up. Mm, let's drop the hatchets. Blip plop. Let's drop the aluminum wires. Oh yeah, I think I told you that yesterday, but I have kind of sorted out my base a bit. You might not believe that. You might think, Sayak, like you lying. I did sort out my base a bit. So first of all, I moved my aluminum wires and my nails to this chest. I didn't mean to drop uh, aluminum bars there. I did move some things around here, here. I now have more space here. I have an entire empty rack here. So once my goop chests fill up, by goop chests, I mean like these chests. Well, like, they don't have, like, a specific storage room. Also, this chest is full right now, so... 
There's that, ladies and gentlemen. Everything is kind of more sorted out. Everything is better. Very organized. It is very organized. Thank you. Thank you for your kind words, sir. Unless that was sarcasm, then I don't appreciate it. It's like, get your drone on your feet to play. I mean, we will probably get it one day. Oh, there's still a raid outside, and I'm like, wait, where are the raiders? We have still the second raid, ladies and gentlemen. We have it. We have a second raid. One, two, three, four. Five. Hell yeah! Let's get this. And I'm ready. Also some hatchets. Five hatchets. Because I never leave my base with that five normal hatchets and five iron hatchets when I go for a raid. That's what I like to do. Pin some caps at the gas station. Have so much. We do have like, what, six or seven thousand of these caps. We need to do something. We, we could spin some of them, but at the same time... Do we have to? Do you want me to spin them? Uh, Alright, we need to get a C4. Another C4? Yes. Another Glock? Yes. Are you ready, ladies and gentlemen? Have you buckled up? I don't think so. Um... This, this, this. I mean, that'll be only one raid. I mean, so you can un unbuckle your one seed belt. Because you were supposed to have two seed belts for the previous raid. This raid, I think, will require only one seed belt. It's like, what on earth are you talking about? Nothing. And the copper. The copper goes all the way up here. It's the sheer distance that I have to walk in my base just to sort things out. <sighs> I'm thinking about moving this warehouse perhaps somewhere closer, but how am I going to do it? I don't think so. Warehouse and that chest, like both of these things could be a little bit closer. Maybe that's what I should do. Maybe, like, somewhere outside here. Maybe that's what I'll do, perhaps. I don't know. In any case, I'm hopping on a chest and I'm going for the raid number three of the day. And yeah, to those curious what's in the down left corner here, it's Fishing Clash. Make sure to check out Fishing Clash. It's a fishing mobile game. It's available on Android and iOS. It's the sponsor of today's live stream. Make sure to support them, because by supporting them, you're supporting me. So maybe we'll work with them in the future. Maybe. I don't know. In any case, we are raiding now the base named the Boss 71. Let's go for it. LDOE. Raid the Boss 71. Hmm. Maybe this raid is decent as well. I didn't even give a rating to the previous base. I mean, I did get Sykes approval. Does this base get... A Sykes approval, I have no idea. This is a weird base, ladies and gentlemen. We will require a lot of C4s for it. Okay, so I see how to raid it. I drop a C4 here. Okay, and then I drop one more C4... There, so this base will require two C4s. Correct? Correct, unless I'm wrong. Hopefully, I'm not wrong. Um, we need another C4. Ladies and gentlemen, let's take another C4. Let's pocket it and let's go. It's a very expensive raid if you want to loot all. Is it worth it though, says Insane? It doesn't really matter if the raid is worth it or not. We're gonna raid it anyways. We have gathered here for the raid. We will raid it. I'm 
All right, I'm gonna drop a C4 here. There we go. Do it anyway for the boys. That's what we are gonna do. That's what we're doing right now. So this base is gonna have three chests. And I am sure that I can place one more C4 somewhere up there. Whoops, I almost stepped on the spike traps. Whoops, almost, I mean, I did actually poke myself with the spike traps. Okay, I think I have to place the C4 here then, perhaps. No, that's the wrong one, idiot! Guys, you, you saw that I placed there, it didn't work. Stupid game. Oh my god, it's like, don't say that about Lazarus. What? That it didn't listen to me? That it didn't place the C4 in the right spot? You saw it yourself, guys. You saw it. I Here, place it here. That's where the dude was supposed to place it. <sighs> it's fine, guys. It is what it is. Sad Cyric. Nah, nah, it's fine. Maybe like my mildly infuriated Cyric. But not sad. Totally not sad, Cyric. Mildly infuriated, Cyric. That's me. For a VSS, that's why I... That's what I... What? Just for a VSS? I expected some more stuff. I just saw a video on YouTube where a dude exploded that room and I expected I'll get something better. I didn't even see what I'll get there. I just saw that they exploded it. For a VSS. C4 for a VSS. Not worth it. However, I still did it. Oh, here we got a Glock and a SWAT armor. It's like was just showing us where not to put the C4 when we need to raid this base. Absolutely, I confirm. Yes, that's what I've done. Totally. Okay, whatever. Let's get the thick fabric then. Maybe I am out of it at the base. Uh, whatever. Let's get the nails. Then we have one more chest to open up. A minigun. Excuse me, sir. What happened to it? Dude, I had the minigun. Where did it go? Maybe it fit in my inventory. Well, I have it here, whatever. Good. Even two C4s are not worth that. I mean, I could place one more C4 somewhere randomly, but I don't know if that'll do anything. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, I'll quickly... Do some more research. I need some more research, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. Is this base any good? Or maybe that's it. Maybe that's all we get from the base. Did I get the few guns? I didn't get all of them, however. I got only three guns. There were supposed to be more guns in this base. Unless I needed one more wall. Guys, I will use one more C4. Psych, don't do it! I know you want me to waste those C4s. Like, even if we get nothing behind that door, you still want me to explode it. So I will do it. For the science and education. I'm doing it. Um, there we go. Oh, my inventory's full. It's not a problem, is it? However, I need to probably drop some stuff in the chopper. Let's go for it. Let's drop the stuff in the chopper. Let's get a C4 and let's explode one more wall. Not really worth it. Batteries and a few guns. Hmm. I didn't even loot the chopper. Put 
Put another weapon in the pocket. Oh, yes, we have to do that. Thank you. Let's get a C4. And let's get to work. Let's explode it. 100 noise, yikes. I might actually die here. I kind of want to skedaddle from here before I get stuck. Well, was it worth it? I don't know. For three guns, for one more C4, at least we've done something with it. So, does this base get Psychic's approval? I'm going to give it Psychic's approval. I did use a lot of C4s for it. I used, like, what? Four C4s? Excuse me? Four C4s? That's a lot of C4s. Well, I did use a lot of C4s, in any case. Like, it's at least a three out of ten. I'll take it. I'll take the loot. I'll take it. And let's see how much thick fabric I had at the base. Somebody said that... I guess Sam in the chat said that I didn't have enough thick fabric, so I'm actually worried. Maybe I don't have enough thick fabric. Okay, we still have 100. Oh, I had only 60 because I brought more thick fabric to the base. So, okay, I did not have a lot of thick fabric. Okay. That's good that I brought some of it. And you're like, Sark, what are we gonna do now? Another raid. Today's a raid day, ladies and gentlemen. More raids. More! Let's drop the four guns. W and L raids. Eh. It was an okay raid. I'd rather get raids like that than raids that give nothing. In my humble opinion. I'll drop the minigun here. My armor goes here. Oh, I do have some space here. How lovely. I forgot where I keep my coupons. I want to drop them here. We have a lot of yellow. Like, way too many yellow coupons. And yet I'm still bringing more of them back to the base here. Doesn't make any sense. Okay, let's drop the gasoline and let's talk to the raiders. Let's give them an electronic circuit. Probably not an electronic circuit. I'll give them a spear. Yes. And we'll call them again. Let's prepare for one more raid. There we go. That spear was plenty. Let's call them here. After raid, maybe the laboratory. Like, the, the reason why I'm not the biggest fan of the laboratory, because first of all, it's... There's nothing that'll get there, and second of all, it takes a long time. Like, it'll take us an hour, an hour and a half to clear the laboratory. Like, it's a very long process to clear that laboratory. Like, I need to dedicate an entire live stream to the laboratory. Another colonel. I've killed that colonel already. We need to raise three true friend doggos, and then we need to make three deals with a dealer. Can I call them on the radio? Brother. No, I don't have dealers on the radio anymore. Am I the only one? Dealers are gone. Where do I find the dealers now? Do I have to go outside and talk to them? Oh, look at this. We need to open up one more blue. That's why I haven't opened up yet. He's been removed, says support. That's stupid. That's an L. That's stupid, actually. Okay, let's sort of raise some of these doggos. And speaking of doggos, I have a Rottweiler in my pocket. In my inbox, I mean. Kefir removed the call. That's silly. I don't know why they did that. <sighs> but what can I do? Oh, 
Okay, let's crossbreed. And that is it, I can't do anything else. All right. We did it, I think I raised three doggos. And yeah, we have the right Weiler from the previous season pass. I might as well just unbox it. Okay, excuse me, where is it? There we go. Now go out and play with your friends. Tucker. We have to follow the tradition. Gooper with a big R because it's a Rottweiler. Ah! Makes no sense. It'll be easier for me to see it. Do we just raise him like this? We could do it, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, we can skip it with an ad even. I mean, I'm gonna feed the dogs. I will skip it and we'll see what we get. Sounds like a plan, right? Skip it, says Angel. That's what we are doing. We are gonna skip it. Okay. The food thing started going down. Uh, let's go here. And this. And uh, I guess we can watch the ad. Zach, show me the ad! I can't show it to you. The game lagged even! I need to reload last on Earth, ladies and gentlemen. Well, the emulator just got stuck, ladies and gents. That's it. I need to reload it. Okay, let's reload it then. Let's let's reload the game. Imagine armors of goopers gooping everywhere, says oh just I mean I don't have to imagine that I live that life with these doggos. Show the fishing ad in place. That's actually quite genius. We're gonna switch to fishing clash guys. <laughs> to grow the right wilder puppy. Okay, we are supposed to be in the game now, no? It's loading. Okay, can I watch the, the ad now? Perhaps? Um, this, and yes, I can, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, let's try to watch it. So I'm watching the advertisement. But like, Syx, show it to me. Literally a black screen. There we go. Literally, that's what I see, a black screen. It happens so often. In any case... In any... Uh, when more scum, says the Minecrafter. Soonish... Tomorrow there will be a last on Earth free-to-play video, and after... Whenever I upload another video, so in the next, like, few days, there will be scum survival. So tomorrow, last on Earth free-to-play, and after that, there will be a scum survival video. Show your ad. I'm not gonna show it. Action in progress, ladies and gentlemen, we're doing it. We're doing it. We got resilient and companion. This dog fights 100% longer with true friend. I didn't get the true friend. I get the resilient buff. I can. In order to take the trade with a true friend, what does it say? This dog fights 100% longer with true friend. But I need to get the doggo with a true friend perk. I don't have it. So it's kind of pointless. <sighs> they didn't get a true friend doggo. Unbelievable. Resilient is decent. Makes the true friend last longer. Yep. Right, yeah. Okay, let's also open up the blue crate, ladies and gentlemen. And then we can go for the fourth raid of the day. Four raids, ladies and gents. Four raids.
So Starfield content is canceled. Maybe there will be some Starfield in the future here on the channel. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Purple crate. Guys, we're not opening up a purple crate. When will you uh, upload a 60 seconds video? To those that have uh, no clue what is 60 seconds. So recently I've played 60 seconds on the channel. It's a, it's a, some sort of a survival game. And there will be more 60 seconds. I just don't know when. But there will be more. Uh, let's go... Whoa, 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 here. Okay, we need to open up one blue crate. All right, my character could travel a little bit faster. When are you going to upload the next com episode? I think I've just answered that question a few minutes ago. Uh, Soonish, in the next like few days, tomorrow there is a last dinner free to play video. After tomorrow, probably a live stream, maybe after, after tomorrow, another live stream, and then after, after, after tomorrow, there will be scum survival. I don't know how many afters I said there, but it probably made sense. Oh, the game is muted. Oh, yeah. Oops. Sorry, guys. I apologize. Didn't mean to mute it. The ad was muted. Whatever. Let's open this up. We have gotten the handle for the VSS. Plus, we have gotten two blocks that'll take. We got the armor and uh, that's it. We can buckle out of here. What happened to your day R survival series? Guys, when we play a game on the channel, it doesn't necessarily become a series. But there's no more they are. Mostly because not enough people enjoyed it. Like, that's basically the main reason. If we don't continue the series, like, the number one cause is because not enough people enjoyed it. But the second cause with they are is I also got, like, some comments saying that the game is goob. Don't play it, Cyric. It's a very pay-to-win game. Blah, blah, blah. Like, there was some drama surrounding they are, so I'm not playing more they are. But it's a fun game. I did enjoy they are while it lasted. Surrounded? There might be more Surrounded in the future. I don't know the exact date for Surrounded. Totally. I have no idea when we'll play more Surrounded. I need to find some space for armor. Plop, plop, plop. And more Glocks, I guess. Let's drop them. And there we go. We have just sorted out the inventory. And we are ready to go for another raid, ladies and gents. Aren't we? How beautiful. How's your day been? It's going great. Hopefully your day's going great as well, Puffchi. Puffchi123. What a beautiful name. Okay, and here, guys, I also moved my caps. Because keeping caps in this chest wasn't very smart. So I moved them to another chest. Mod the Glocks. We're going to mod them before the raid. Okay, I just want to see if we are done with all the tasks. Okay, we also need to craft the armor. Uh, so I guess let's craft it. Let's craft that body armor. Oh no, I didn't mean to craft both of them. Oh no, I didn't mean to craft two helmets. That's silly. I need to craft the tactical body armor, the trousers, and the boots. There we go. And that is it. I think we are ready to go for the raid, ladies and gentlemen. Um... Are we ready to go for the raid? We should be ready to go for the raid. I haven't seen an ATV transmission in Transport Hub, says Frosty. I think I've seen one. I think it is possible to get an ATV transmission in in the Transport Hub. So, guys, we're going to play now some Fishing Clash. Don't leave as we're going to go and uh, do a raid very soon. Except before that, we're going to do a short sponsored segment of... Of, of fishing clash here. Uh, so yeah, 
Uh, once again, huge thanks to Fishing Clash for sponsoring this live stream. It's a mobile fishing game. Make sure to check it out. Link is down in the description. It's available on Android and iOS. You can also scan this QR code in the down left corner. And once you get the game, make sure to go to the here in the top right corner. You'll find like this hamburger menu or whatever people call it. You click here on the gift codes and type here Happy Sire, which is the name of this channel, right? Type Happy Sire and you'll be able to get lots of awesome rewards here. You'll be able to get uh, $20 worth of rewards for free. And if I'm not mistaken, you'll be able to get like a unique... Uh, Avatar, you'll be able to get a mythical lore card, 50 lock power-ups, and 30 weight power-ups. And those things will help you to catch bigger fish. So basically, this game is all about fishing. You probably know fishing, right? Fishing is epic. And yeah, guys, uh, let's also create a clan here. You'll be able to join it. Wait, let's go to clans. Let's create one. And uh, we can change this the, the, the avatar of clan... Uh, uh, I'm gonna get the car here. It looks funny. Okay, let's get the car. And name of the clan is gonna be Happy Cyric, right? Clan description. Uh, Happy Cyric. Whoops. Happy Cyric. Clan type open and country. Can we say global? All world. There we go, guys. We can create it. So now you'll be able to join the clan. So make sure to join the clan. To those that have got in the game and yeah in the game here uh, let me quickly explain how it works so basically there are lots of different maps you unlock these maps by by leveling up and yeah currently i have unlocked here 20 something 30 something maps wait i forgot we have 23 maps the last map that i've unlocked is this lost world and yeah we fished We've already done, like, we've already fished here a bit during the live stream. We fished in Himalayas. I haven't fished in California. Let's go to California then. Boom. Let's transport ourselves over here. And, uh, yeah, let me show you. Uh, let me explain some more stuff here. So, basically, we have this universe, universal lure. And with this lure, we can catch, like, all the fish here probably. And then, yeah, we have some different lures as well. Let's get this. Let's probably catch here a fish or two. And then I'm going to show you some other game modes. Because there is also dual mode where you can play against other players. Okay. And let's see what kind of fish we got here. Okay, we got this California scorpion fish. Alrighty. Let's claim that. And how about we get this universal lore? And let's get a fish here. So, guys, make sure to check out the game. Make sure to support the developers that support the channel. Because with the sponsors like Fish and Clash, we get to play more Lions Than Earth. I get to continue doing YouTube. So, yeah. Make sure to support the devs. Thank you, guys. Let's claim this. And yeah, I mean, we can probably go to a different map here. Whatever. Let's go to uh, Great Barrier Reef. Dude, it looks kind of poggers here. It looks pretty. Let's go here. And I'm going to show you the duels here. Let's click on the duel. And let's see what uh, where they will put us. Choose your duel fish. Oh, we have this uh, blue trout legendary. Okay, let's get it because maybe the guy's not going to have the blue trout here. I have no idea what kind of fish the dude selected. A brown trout. Do I have a brown trout? No, I don't. I only have this. Uh, I, I don't think I have anything. In any case, let's go for it. I think I'll lose this duel. That's what I have to say. Okay, what did they get here? Arctic Grayling. That's not what I... That's not what I signed up for. We can get this sonar thing upgrade. And uh, blue trout or brown trout. A rainbow trout. Pink salmon. Silver salmon. Arctic. Uh, brown trout. There we go. Using sonar, I was able find a brown trout. Let's 
go for it. The guy had 422 weight uh, units or whatever for the brown trout. Okay, this one is 497. That's great. That is buggers. I don't think he can get the the blue trout. I don't think he can find it though. Okay. So far we are winning. The dude got a silver salmon. And I think we're gonna win this round. We did it because I did find a, bla a blue trout. There we go, guys. The duel has ended and I won. I got two of these hooks. Plus we got some more coins. All right, let's claim that. We got this, we got that. Oh, the blue trout, this is the one. I thought I have it in any case. Uh, what map even is this? Oh, can I river? It's pretty poggers here as well. Wait, let's open these things up now because we got some more lures. Okay, this thing will open up in quite a while. Let's open it up. And yeah, by opening up these chests, by doing duels and everything, you get here uh, things to progress and upgrade your account. We've gotten here some different fishing rods for different locations. We can open this thing up. And then I'll do one more duel because I want to get enough fishing hooks. And you need like 10 fishing hooks to open up a chest. Okay, we've gotten here some things for the California map. And check this out, guys. We have this thing. The blue hooks in duels. You can win you can win blue hooks in duels to unlock the lure pack. So let's go for one more duel then. I'm ready for it. So guys, make sure to check out Fishing Clash if you haven't checked it out yet. Link is down in the description and make sure to join our clan. Okay, another blue trout and I don't have it. Whatever, I'm just going to take it. Cause so that nobody gets it. We need a cutthroat trout. Oh, I do have a cutthroat trout here. I can just... Oh, I can upgrade it already here in the map. Amazing. Let's get the weight. And uh, let's catch it. Okay, they might actually get a better fish than me. They got 354 points for that fish. And I got... How many points? I think I'll see here. It'll be faster. Oh, I didn't even get the cutthroat trout. Whatever. I'm gonna get the luck. We still have 40 seconds. Okay, hopefully this time I'll get lucky and I'll get that cutthroat trout. Pink salmon. Dude, you gotta be kidding me. I lost my mouse. Uh, this. Okay. Still have 20 seconds. I don't want to lose this duel because I need one more fishing hook and then I'll be able to open up that chest there. Did that work? There we go. We got the cutthroat trout. Is it? Again, I lost my mouth. My mouse. 522. No, it wasn't heavy enough. <sighs> I lost. Disappointment is immeasurable. Maybe still got some hooks. I got zero hooks though. Whatever. I'm not giving up. I'm going for one more battle. Well, let's drink something. And let's go for one more battle because I need two more hooks and then I'll be able to open this thing up. Let's go, ladies and gents. Let's do it! Uh, okay. I'm gonna take my Florida thing. Understandable. Have a nice day. What are you doing? We're playing some uh, fishing clash. Okay, I can upgrade my fish. There we go. At least I'm going to demolish this dude. Uh, This one. There we go. Let's go for it. I couldn't demolish the other guy. At least I'll demolish this dude. Okay, we got the max combo. Okay, we got this red lionfish. Okay, now we need this red grouper i will upgrade it as well in front of this dude just to be able to catch a bigger fish this dude doesn't stand a chance against us i'll get my two hooks
And there we go. That's the red grouper. That's exactly what the doctor ordered. And that is it. There ain't no way that the dude can do anything. I guess we can just keep fishing because we still have 15 seconds here. Until the duel ends. There we go. That's a dual end. And I'm pretty sure we're going to get both of these hooks now. Let's claim this. And there I completely demolished this dude. And we have gotten three hooks. Let's claim that. Wait, I kind of want to travel to a different map. Because different ones look cooler. Uh, the Mekong River. There we go. Looks fine. Let's go here. There we go. And now we can open up the special hook pack thing. All right, here we were able to get some pearls, some coins. We were able to upgrade our... We've gotten a bunch of different cards for different fish here. Let's claim all of that. And wait, let's check the clan. Okay, hi, Cyrix, sub chat. So guys, make sure to join our clan if you haven't uh, gotten... A fishing class yet make sure to get it link is in the description there's the qr code in the down left corner and then click on clans here and find our clan just type happy cyric and you'll be able to join our clan hello there we go we got that i think we can uh go for the fishing battle wait except for the fishing battle i'm gonna go to a different place for example to to this one can i river And let's start a fishing battle. It's a different game mode here as well. When will we play Last Earth? There will be more Last Earth, guys. Now we are checking out Fishing Clash. There will be more Last Earth very soon. We're going to raid a base there. There we go. We just found eight players. Do I have a chance against them? Probably not. I'm just gonna get destroyed. We need to find the white tip reef shark. And I don't even have one. <sighs> okay, let's try to find it. White tip. White tip something Mexican. Not this one. I don't even have it. Nope. 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 Well, whatever, I'll just fish at least something. If I'll have enough time, I have only seven seconds left here. But uh, even if I... There we go, I got that fish. Did I get the right fish? Kick King Angel. Angel fish. And that's it. And I lost because I didn't get the right fish. <gasps> oh, plus we got another one of those. Let's open up another pack here. All right, we got some different fishing rods for different maps. Understandable. Have a, have a nice day. I'll probably go for another duel. Let's see where they can put me. Um, okay, we have this actually, Florida Coast. Uh, Boneth Head Shark. Okay, cool. Let's get it. And we should be able to completely obliterate this guy. Because we have this legendary thing. There we go. We got one of the sharks. Let's claim that. And we need now this Dusky Smooth Hound. Let's get the Dusky Smooth Hound. So yeah, I'm pretty sure we're going to win this battle as well. Okay, that boat there, guys. Did you see it in the background? It just scared all of my fish. Yeah, there's no way the dude's gonna do anything about it. Oh, wait, we can upgrade these fish. Why wouldn't I upgrade them? 
Oh, that's a night one. I got the three hooks. Thank you, sir. Thank you for the three hooks. Really cool. Also, there's another thing. I don't think I really explained this, but the main way to progress here in the game is by doing here all sorts of quests here. So on the left side, you can see these different uh, events that you can do. For example, right now here in this, whatever this map is called, the Kenai River, right? In this Kenai River, there's this, the Legend of Gallops. Actually, the Legend of Gallops is in everything. But yeah, here you can uh, do these, like, win a streak of four duels with the Prickly Shark. You'll be able to win this, and you'll get, like, some points. Once you complete all of these quests, you'll be able to get here different chests. And each, each of these chests contain, like, some nice and awesome rewards. Uh, here we have another event here. We have the Shark Bite. Catch a fish at the Hawaii Fishery. Let's probably go here, and we'll be able to get 25 or something points for this event here. There we go. So we'll get 25 points for it, and I'm ready for it. So let's try to catch a fish. And just like that, we'll get 25 points. And then we'll be able to open up a box, and from that box, we'll be able to get some fish. Uh, fish cards, and then with these cards, you upgrade your fish. And once you upgrade your fish, you level up. And once you level up, you will be able to unlock more maps. Let's get that. There we go, we've just gotten here 25 points. Oh, actually we can get, we need to catch 10 fish to get 25 points. And now we have to also catch the Reef Rebel. We have to catch 20 times. Understandable, have a nice day. For 1,000 points, win a duel with the Reef Rebel, getting a score advantage for both fish. Okay. Uh, catch a Reef Rebel with at least five stars. Understandable, have a nice day. Do I even have these Reef Rebels? I oh, know I haven't even logged these Reef Rebels yet. Understandable, have a nice day. Whatever, let's keep catching the fish, then maybe I'll unlock the Reef Rebel or something. A sunken box. No, I don't think we have sunken boxes here. However, we do have fish. There's also a boss fish. I've caught like some big fish that have lots of health. Indo-Pacific sailfish. Let's claim it. Very beautiful. No, oh, plus we've gotten this uh, orange pack of lures. Let's start it and let's open it up. Why wouldn't I open it up? Okay, here we go. We've gotten some more different fish. Now we can upgrade them by, and by upgrading them, check this out. We can get these points, right? We can get plus 10 experience and yeah, that's how we level up. And you need to level up in order to unlock here different maps. Now I'm level 130 to unlock another map. We have to be... To unlock this Lake uh, Constance, we have to be level 133. To upgrade that, we need to... Uh, uh, we need to keep upgrading the cards. So, there's that. So, ladies and gentlemen, that was Fishing Clash. Once again, shout out to Fishing Clash for sponsoring the live stream. Make sure to check out Fishing Clash. Make sure to also join our... 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 Uh... Our clan, uh, it's called Happy Cyric. And yeah, once you get the game, make sure to claim the code. Click here on gift codes, type here Happy Cyric. Whoops. Type here Happy Cyric and you will be able to get $20 worth of rewards. So yeah, once again, shout out to Fish Clash. Thank you guys for supporting the live stream. And thank you for supporting the developers because the developers like Fish and Clash the sponsors like Fishing Clash, they support the live stream and with their help, we can do more last internet videos and bunch of other stuff here on the channel. So yeah, make sure to support the, the, the sponsor. Thank you guys very much. And we're gonna get back to last internet now because as I said, we still have a raid to do in last day on earth. Nancy girl says, cool fishing game. Thank you. I mean, it is a cool fishing game, yes. I agree. It is a fun fishing game. So now let's go for the raid. All right. Um... I think this armor is going to be enough for the raid, right? 
It's plenty. It's plenty of armor. Let's go for it, ladies and gents. Let's buckle up. This will be our fourth raid of the day, believe it or not. I mean, I don't know why we why wouldn't you believe that, but this is our fourth raid. We've done one like normal raid, then we've done a revenge raid, then another normal raid. And plus we have one more raid here. Mod your weapons. Yes, that's what we're gonna do. Where is it? Where are my beans? I gotta eat the beans. Uh, and some hatchets. Let's get the hatchets. And hey, while we're getting the hatchets, guys, so yeah, make sure to also check out that fishing lash. We just played it. It was a sponsored segment. Make sure to support the devs because they did support the channel. And with their help, we can do more live streams. I can pay rent. So guys, thank you. Thank you for supporting them. Thank you for supporting the live stream. Take the drone uh, to raid for science, says Matthew Spellman. You know what? It's a good idea. I kind of want to take the drone for science. I want to see if it makes noise. Like, I'm not even kidding. That is a good idea. I like it. Imagine playing fishing clash while fishing IRL, says uh, Zax. Like, you might say that I'm crazy or I'm lying, but I did have a friend that, like, fished a lot. And he played a lot of fishing games on his mobile, and he was fishing and playing the game. Like, I kid you not. It do be like that. Okay, so let's get out of here. Let's complete. And let's go for the fourth raid of the day. That would be goaded. Yeah. I mean, it is possible to fish and play a fishing game. Usually if you fish, like, you are into those fishing games. So, yeah. Uh, Chiara. Looks like I know this name. Either we had a viewer on the channel named Chiara or something. LDE Raid Chiara. A C4. I didn't get a C4. I should get a C4. Oh, lord. Let's get a C4. Unless this raid doesn't require a C4. Actually, this raid requires two C4s, ladies and gentlemen. Two C4s, not one! Not five, but two. Okay, one here and one where? Here and there. Okay, I see. See, ladies and gentlemen. Did you bring a C4 W chat once again, says Grim? Absolutely, without the chat, I would have forgotten them. We have only one more C4 here, and then I'll have to get another one from the inbox. <sighs> Massive C4 day today. Absolutely. We did use up a lot of C4s. It has many first aid kits and guns. It do be like that. When will you do more free to play series? Says Kaseba. Tomorrow, guys. Tomorrow there's a new free to play video. Perhaps a sneak peek. I mean, what can I sneak peek? I can only uh, sneak peek a thumbnail, so I mean, it doesn't really matter. So, guys, tomorrow there is a new free-to-play video. That's what I can say for sure. Unless something happens, unless tomorrow, guys, we get a helicopter released in Last and Earth Survival, then there won't be a free-to-play video. Or maybe, like, some sort of another, like, crazy thing gets released that I have to, like, upload it that day. But there's, like, a 99.9% .9 chance that tomorrow will be a free-to-play video. Would you do a brand new free-to-play series, says Cabson? I'm out. That's it. No. We've just literally started a free-to-play series, like... Three weeks ago, maybe. What do you mean, a new free-to-play series? Hello? I've just started a new free-to-play series three weeks ago. Uh, three weeks ago. Start again. Start again. Hell yeah. Start over. Excuse me, sir. Just literally started it. Like, believe it or not, I have started, like, maybe my second free-to-play playlist. I have no idea how many free-to-play playlists I have already. Like, maybe five or something. But I know that during my second free-to-play playlist, I was like, okay, that's the last one that I that I ever do. 
And then I started my third one. I was like, okay, this is like 100% the last one, let's say. And... Uh, I was like almost sure that I won't start another free-to-play account. So here we go, and I'll probably like five more free-to-play accounts later. And we've just started one more recently. And now people are asking me for another free-to-play account. Unbelievable. He has 84 accounts and 83 of them are free-to-play. Exactly. It do be like that. Okay, here we've gotten some healing items. Let's take these schmucks to the base. Let's do it. Let's absolutely do it. Let's get the paints. Let's get the... The tactical armor. I don't really... I don't know if it's actually really fun to start over... Gives the game more of a challenge. I mean... I start the game over for the content. Because not everybody plays this game for for a long time. So I usually start a new account like once a year, you know? I start my new free-to-play playlist. I start new free-to-play series. A lot of new people that found the channel, they follow those free-to-play series. And after a while, that's it. Those people are gone because they stopped playing Last Generate. Last Generate doesn't have like a long longevity. Like a lot of people stop playing this game after a few months. A lot of those people just leave. And the next year, I start new free-to-play series for new people. And... That's what I've been doing, kind of. There are obviously lots of you here in the chat that have been following the channel for more than a year. For a few years. But yeah. Shout out to you guys. Let's open up now the third chest, probably. Here and here. There we go. Steal this. What's the point of the drone if you don't use it? Because I forgot about it. I'll use it right now. You could remind it instead of saying, what's the point of the drone if you don't use it? You could say that, hey, you forgot to use the drone. Because I did forget it. Will even the zombie spawn? I'm going to destroy more things just so that the zombies spawn. It's getting dangerous here, my character says. Okay. Boomer. Okay, now they'll spawn. I'm sure about it. There we go. Let's use the drone and let's see if it makes any noise. It doesn't. Okay, so the drone doesn't make any noise. There we go. Scientific fact now. The drone doesn't make noise during raids. Okay, my armor is about to break, so... I'm gonna deal with these guys. Real quick. Did they nerf Bunker Alpha? No, they didn't. It's still the same. Still the same good old Bunker Alpha. And whatever, I'll just bring this garbage armor back to the base. Whatever, let's get... Actually, no, not whatever. I know what I'll do. There we go, let's skedaddle. So does this base get Cyrus approval? Absolutely. This is probably the best raid that we've raided today. For 2C Force, it was worth it. In my opinion, It's a, it was a nice raid. Okay, let's drive back here. Here's what we're gonna do, ladies and gentlemen. I didn't want to delete that armor there. Because first of all, you can't delete anything during raids. And second of all, I'll just do this. There we go. We're gonna drop that broken armor there. I don't have to delete it. And plus, raiders will be able to steal it from the bait chest. Genius. Oh, no. Oh, no. These things don't fit. Um... Aluminum wires and uh, I mean, whatever I'll drop These things here for now, it's like some sort of an empty chest not fully but it's some sort of an empty chest there whatever There we 
there's that an electronic circuit So I start a brand new account where you will play without backpacks. I mean, it's not a bad idea, to be honest. I have actually thought of that already. Like, I did want to make an I did want to make an account like that already. But when you think about it, what are we gonna do there? I think it would be more fun if we had an account where. Where you can't store anything at the base. Where you are a chest. Where you are... You are not allowed to use chests. Like, only your backpack. Like, your character is your storage. Like, I would be actually more curious to see if we can survive that way. If we could at least assemble a chopper. That would be, like, our goal. Can, we, can you assemble a chopper without using base storage? Just, like, having your character there. Like, would that be possible? I think that would be like a very fun challenge that I would actually like love to do. I've been thinking about it for a while now. Doesn't mean that we'll like continue playing in that account. It's just like to get the chopper there and that's it. Once we are done getting the chopper, like goodbye that account. Like I'd be curious to see if it's even possible. Like, all of our medkits, all of our loot will be just on our body. No armor would be hard. I mean, we would have armor, but that's it. Like, I wouldn't have enough space in my inventory to do anything. Like, we would have to only get the most important things to assemble the chopper. Like, I wouldn't be able to store anything at the base. That would be hard, says Graham. That would be hard, but that's the whole point. That would be, like, some sort of a challenge. That would actually be a fun challenge. Um... Oh yeah, I wanted to go to the settlement because I haven't done anything in the settlement today yet. I said just do it. Okay. When we have the free-to-play series going. Like, once we're done with the free-to-play, maybe I'll do that idea. I had that idea for, like, for, for maybe two years now. Will there be more 60 seconds? Yes. We will play more 60 seconds. Um, the brain is working at full capacity. We gotta get charcoal. We gotta get some planks, some iron. How often does your base get raided? I mean, it depends. If you do lots of raids, then maybe it'll get raided often. If you don't do lots of raids, then it won't get raided often. Okay, that's what I'll get. Let's go now to the settlement. Good point. If you do that challenge, you can't use the inbox, says Grim. But, like, what's the point that I... Why can't I use the inbox? If I can't... I can't store anything in the base. You don't store anything in the inbox. You can only take from the inbox. But I get it. Maybe we should, like, remove the inbox. I haven't thought of the inbox. But, like, if I can't... Why can't I use the inbox when you think about it? Like, that would be one of the nice... Benefits that we can do there. To use the inbox to its full fullest potential. You could use rations. Yeah, I mean, I could use rations to get wood, and at least I'd be able to store wood in the inbox. Because, again, guys, getting a chopper with, like, only... Like, I won't even have this tactical backpack. We'll only have, like, wait, how many slots? One, two, three, four, five, like, ten, fifteen. We'll have only, like, fifteen to twenty slots here. And with these fifteen to twenty slots, I'll have to assemble the full chopper. So being able to use the inbox... is probably very important, I think. It'll be, like, part of the strategy, I guess. I think we should be able... I should be able to use the inbox during that challenge. Die and keep body as storage. Nah, it's not. That would be out of the question. Uh, 
Um, okay, we got some of these. That's great. Maybe I'll activate it. Perhaps, perhaps. Could you use truck box at base? Uh, truck box. I don't think so. Because it does have a lot of storage. I mean, inbox really isn't like base storage. Like, I cannot store anything in my base, like anywhere else. I can only use my backpack. And maybe I can take items from the inbox, and that's it. Uh, let's drop these here. Some more of these. Um... I came here to do something, I forgot. I needed to get the screws. Take daily loot. I have already taken the daily loot. I'm actually thinking about the challenge. It sounds fun. I have forgotten about it for a long time. I actually want to try it now. If it would be even possible. Okay, not here. Where's the place where I can drop the things? It's like you need to organize your settlement. It's a mess. It says Saf Saf. Maybe. However, I'm not gonna organize it. But it is a bit messy. I mean, there almost there's almost nothing in the settlement. It can't be messy. It can only be Ronaldo. Okay, we got five of these. There we go, we're getting more and more things. I'm gonna get this to get more uh, sawdust. There we go. The small generator is working. <sighs> now we need to also use this thing. Here we can drop things to get light parts. And with these light parts, I think we can upgrade our things. Okay, actually I can upgrade it once. Oh, that's it. I can't upgrade it again. Dragunovs are easy to get, aren't they? I mean, you can only get one of them from the season. You can get two of them from season pass. And then if you have all the skins in the game, you can get them from infinite packs. Oh no, I can't do this here. I need to move my generator. I don't have enough of these... Engines, generators, whatever. I'll take one from here, though. There we go. We could craft a third one, but two of them is enough. There we go. Let's start it. And there we go. Here we can get some more of these light parts. Who somehow, some way, after like half an hour. How our settlement is booming. We're getting things that we need to get here. Beautiful. How many of these pumps? We need 10 of these pumps here to build this water pump. Well, one, once I need this water pump, I will start finishing it. I'll start building it. But as of right now, I don't think I actually need to do it. So guys, I think we will be wrapping it up. Thanks guys for joining here to the live stream. Once again, thanks to Fishing Clash for sponsoring this live stream. And if you guys haven't gotten it yet, make sure to check it out. Make sure to support the developers. Uh, link is down in the description or scan the QR code here. And yeah, once you get the game, you can join our clan. It's going to be Happy Cyric. Go to clan, click Happy Cyric. 
type Happy Cyric and you'll be able to, uh, to to join our clan there. So yeah, make sure to check out the Fishing Clash because of sponsors like Fishing Clash. I'm allowed and I can do whatever we want here on YouTube. And I can pay rent and I can pay for bread. So yeah, guys, make sure to check them out. And yeah, take care guys. See you tomorrow with another free-to-play video because we haven't released a free-to-play in a long time. Wait, I actually want to see how... When was the last free-to-play video? How long was it? Our previous free-to-play was... Oof! It was quite a long time ago! Two weeks ago, guys. Two weeks ago! Why Why nobody has told me that it's been two weeks ago? Yikes, hey guys, tomorrow, 100%. Tomorrow there will be a new free-to-play episode. Like, absolutely. 100%. I can't even maybe tell you how it's called. I mean, it doesn't really matter how it's called, but there will be a free-to-play episode. That is it, 100%. I think we are going to clear the farm there. It is called Cheapest Way to Clear the Farm. Updated. That's how it's called, ladies and gentlemen. So yeah, we're going to clear the farm tomorrow. See you later. And yeah, once again, make sure to check out Fishing Clash. And take care, everybody. See you later, alligators. Peace out, Shadow, to all of you. Shout out to Fishing Clash and shout out to you guys. Take care. See you later and peace out, guys.